dimethylheptylpyrin DMHP 2 dimethylheptyl delta 6A 10A THC 1 2 dimethylheptyl delta 3 THC A40824 EA2233 is a synthetic analog of THC which was invented in 1949 during attempts to elucidate the structure of delta 9 THC one of the active components of cannabis DMHP is a pale yellow, viscous oil which is insoluble in water, but dissolves in alcohol or nonpolar solvents. Effects DMHP is similar in structure to THC, differing only in the position of one double bond, and the replacement of the 3-pentyl chain with a 3-1-2-dimethylheptyl chain. It produces similar activity to THC, such as sedative effects, but is considerably more potent, especially having much stronger analgesic and anticonvulsant effects than THC, although comparatively weaker psychological effects. It is thought to act as a CB1 agonist, in a similar manner to other cannabinoid derivatives. <laughs> Investigation as non-lethal incapacitating agent DMHP and its O-acetate ester were extensively investigated by the U.S. Military Chemical Weapons Program in the Edgewood Arsenal experiments, as possible non-lethal incapacitating agents. DMHP has three stereocenters and consequently has eight possible stereoisomers, which differ considerably in potency. The racemic mix of all eight isomers of the O-acetyl ester was given the code number EA2233, with the eight individual isomers numbered EA2233-1 through EA2233-8. The most potent isomer was EA2233-2, with an active dose range in humans of 0.5 to 2.8 micrograms per kilogram i.e. approximately 35 to 200 micrograms for a 70 kilograms adult. Active doses varied markedly between individuals, but when the dose of EA2233 was taken up to 1 to 2 mg, all volunteers were considered to be incapable of performing military duties, with the effects lasting as long as 2 to 3 days. DMHP is metabolized in a similar manner to THC, producing the active metabolite 11 hydroxy DMHP, but the lipophilicity of DMHP is even higher than that of THC itself, giving it a long duration of action and an extended half life in the body of between 20 and 39 hours, with the half life of the 11 hydroxy DMHP metabolite being longer than 48 hours. Cannabinoids as a class are generally safe compounds with a large safety margin, making potent cannabinoid drugs ideal as potential non-lethal incapacitating agents. DMHP and its esters produce sedation and mild hallucinogenic effects similar to large doses of THC, but in addition to this they also cause pronounced hypotension low blood pressure, which occurs at doses well below the hallucinogenic dose, and can lead to severe dizziness, fainting, ataxia and muscle weakness, sufficient to make it difficult to stand upright or carry out any kind of vigorous physical activity. The acute toxicity of DMHP was found to be low in both human and animal studies, with the ratio of ED50 to LD50 therapeutic index in animals being around 2,000 times, with death ultimately resulting from a combination of hypotension and hypothermia and preventable with supportive treatment. The combination of strong incapacitating effects and a favorable safety margin led the Edgewood Arsenal team to conclude that DMHP and its derivatives, especially the O-acetyl ester of the most active isomer, EA22332, were among the more promising non-lethal incapacitating agents to come out of their research program. However they were disadvantaged by producing severe hypotension at incapacitating doses, and were not as effective as the more widely publicized anticholinergic agents such as 3-quinuclidinyl benzylate which had also already been weaponized. Funding for continued development was ultimately not approved, and the cannabinoid research program was indefinitely suspended along with the rest of the Edgewood Arsenal experiments in the late 1970s, in accordance with the U.S. commitment to cease research into chemical weapons under disarmament treaties. Isomerism Note that 6H dibenzo B, D, P -Y -R -A -N -1 -O -L is the same as 6H benzo C, -C -H -R -O -M -E -N -1 -O -L. 